Good morning, everyone. Myself Nandini Ennu, studying in an 8A, Naradipa Senior Secondary School, Javali, Shumoka. Today, the experiment I am doing is a homemade aloe vera hand sanitizer. You know why I am doing this experiment? Because there is a great demand all over the world for the sanitizer. You know, because what is the reason behind that? Because of the novel coronavirus which have affected all over the world and people are suffering from that. So more demands, more expensive items. So reducing this, being at our home, using our household things, we can make a household hand sanitizer. So only easy items are used. Everything will be in your house. Please be home and stay safe. So the items are needed, I'll say. And what are the uses also, I'll say. So the first item is very important. That's the aloe vera gel. You know, this gel is, you can see this is the aloe vera, which can be available in every house. So please don't go out to get an aloe vera gel. You can make a hormone. See, as I no chemical effects, only naturally. So this contains antibacterial, antifungus and antiviral property which helps to clean the fungus and a bacteria virus in our hands. So it also kills the, all the germs in our hands. So next, as you can see, alcohol spirit. It's also known as the rubbing spirit which helps to kill all the germs and every bad microbes in our hands. So this is the second most important thing to make a sanitizer. And the third thing is an essential oil there is no particular reason to use a only a eucalyptus oil as i'm using eucalyptus oil what is availability in your house please use that please be in your house stay safe so as i have eucalyptus oil you can use a tree tree oil or lemon oil lemon oil so this is helpful for a fragrance for a sanitizer and the fourth thing is a capsule this is a capsule which I put for the sanitizer, which is a good preservator. You can see this will be available in the medical shops. Medical shops will be open. You can buy it. Vitamin E. Yeah, vitamin E capsule. This is known as a vitamin E capsule. So these are the main what we use for the hand sanitizer. So let's start. This is the measuring jar. Measuring jar is important because to measure the spirit is already is very, very important. So... 60 ml of a rubbing spirit or an alcohol spirit. Please don't put, be aware by using this, please wear a hand gloves. I can see 60 ml is enough for this. Yeah, 60 ml is enough. Yeah, close. Good. Now, as I said, 5 to 6, six tablespoon of aloe vera gel. It is naturally homemade and mix it well. Yeah, well. Next, as I said, essential oil. Well for fragrance. And I said as I'm using a vitamin E capsule, which is a good preservation. We're using the oil of it, not a whole capsule. Yeah, you can see the oil inside it. Yeah, this is the one minute. Yeah, mix it well. Mixing is very important at this time. Yeah. Yeah, this is the container which I have in a house. Please be take any container to put a sanitizer. Yeah, yeah for 60 ml only this much is enough. Shake it well. Yeah, this is enough. For a try, I really have to remove my hand gloves. Sure, madam. Yeah. It's done. So, 
This is a hand sanitizer which which is hundred percent naturally, which is homemade. So I'm using it. Coloring. Wow, this fragrance is really nice. So our homemade aloe vera hand sanitizer is ready. This is hundred percent natural, easy. Thank you.